welcome back to another video in this video i'm very excited to show you my top picks that i got in mexico city i did went for vacation with my family and uh, we were there for about four weeks and i just kept going back to the um city the center where they had a whole bunch of stores different type of beauty suppliers like they had it all in there and that's where like i got this whole stuff for less money because it was in pesos the currency within dollars to pesos was about 16 pesos per dollar like every dollar was worth like 16 pesos in mexico city and obviously i did get a whole bunch of deals i was able to manage to get this whole box that i have here um this container full of stuff mainly i went specifically to look for um hand stands designers um it's just basically like hand stands where i will be doing my designs and have it on my showcase um right behind me or like once you come into my working area you'll be able to see all these different types of video so i'm very excited to show you so let's get into it so the first thing i see here it's a kalinsky nail brush this is the brush that i'll be using to be using the acrylic with it is a size number 10 and it has this little rhinestones on it um that's how that looks look at that that's how it's so beautiful um i don't really remember the prices because i i don't know i i don't remember the prices and also because it was like in pesos uh the currency is, is like is different than us dollars so it's like like let's say this was like I think like about 420 450 right 450 pesos but ideally to me like I always be like dollars because I'm used to using the US dollars currency right here um, you know so that was like kind of playing with my mind because I was hearing these high prices but it was in pesos and then until i had to like constantly remember myself or ask my husband like how much is this in dollars or have them you know do the calculator um to do the automatic um currency change and then depending on like what it would be i'm like okay well yeah that's a good deal because in dollar then it would have been it would have cost me more back into the united states so that's what i got a kolinsky brush for it next we have a nail tip cutter and it is on the color rainbow look at that camouflage it's really pretty it's really cute and I got a box of tips I got like two boxes I think and this brings about I think um 500 tips on it the little plastic thing got I took it out because it got dirty but this is some clear tips that I got and the box is like very durable like it feels very hard plastic acrylic like you know very good quality that was another thing I was able to realize over there like they had like good quality um and then I have a lot of mix um different shapes of rhinestones or yeah yeah you can call them like i guess rhinestones and um the crystals there you go crystals for my nail designs i am very excited about this i really want to use them like they have very cute they have hearts rhombus diamonds bows butterflies teardrops square and then they have like the variety of um the, the crystal rhinestones like kind of like imitating the swarovski 
rhinestones right there so i thought that was really cute and the box is convenient because it has uh each compartment of each different divider so i could always go back and refill it when i ride by more and another thing i was obsessed with was this mat this is for my photos um I picked it in silver and like white um, because I thought like it would just be a, cute, a really cute layout whenever I go take my pictures, my clients' pictures, like have their nails and you know I feel like this little nice back background will be very cute on camera. I see it a lot of silver but it does have silver but it's mostly like white, like it has white and since halloween is coming up and the fall like we do have those nice um warm colors coming in because of the season so i feel like any design will look cute like even the nails that i have on you know like they will just like really pop out so i thought this is really good for my pictures okay next we have okay the other box of tips okay so it doesn't have it but i believe they are they usually come with like 500 tips and um this is the the little plastic that the other one i took it away from because it got dirty and um this is just some natural color tips same thing, it's the same quality, the same box, everything. Um, oh, then I got some nail samplers for my designs or my color swatching sticks. And this is in the square tip. Very cute. Um, it comes 50 of those. And I did got I got the square ones and then I had the stiletto, I think, yeah, two, two stiletto, oh, I got two of each, two stiletto and two square ones, so I just thought they were really cute as well, next, um, oh, these rhinestones and pearls are just so very pretty and beautiful, they're, they're the same, yeah they're the same i got two two of the same ones because i just thought they were really cute and i will be planning i'm planning on using most of them or like all of them and the nail design so you can never have too much again my imitation of swarovski rhinestones these i have used them in the past before and they are very lasting like they don't fall off so i got it in the size 10 and then size 3 like the smaller ones this is smaller and these are bigger like size 10 and each of these have 1440 pieces in them so very good and for the thing that I wanted mostly to go find and look was oh, my little nail, well, my hand um, stands. I'll be putting them like that and then I'll just have to create my designs and showcase it whenever my clients come and see me or they want to pick a design or whatever. But I just think like it's really good for decoration and as well to show and pra keep practicing my nails and nail design. So these I got 15 hands, okay, like 15 hands because they were really, they were really cheap. Like how much were they? 11 pesos each hand, 11 pesos. When typically here in the United States, it will be range from like 15 to between I think 15 to between 15 to 20 dollars for one hand and over there I got them for like 
less than a dollar yeah because the one dollar currency change accurate right now as of today um it's 17 pesos like one dollar equals 17 pesos so for these hands i got them for 11 pesos so it's like about 75 cents or so so you know so this is the deals that i'm telling you about that i was able to get my supplies from over there so i got 15 hands and then I also got the for my pedicures showcase, and that's how the fit the feet looks like. Oh, this from the bag. Okay. Um, to also do my pedicures. So these only got six about six of them. Yeah, so only six. I didn't want too many of these. Uh, I mean, I don't know, I feel like pedicures are a little less simpler. They'll be cute and I could just showcase six feet will be fine. Or if I ever go again or I just could go get um, a shipment from them, then I'll be able to do that. But for now, I just want to try out the six feet. Okay. And um, yeah, I think this is everything from this box this i got it um in the city like in centro basically like like a whole avenue where they have all this kind of stuff so yeah i will be putting these i think i'm gonna keep them here because i had already organized them like this so i'll just be taking one by one whenever i do my designs and then these yeah i'll be going ahead and organize it within my nail stuff you know and also all of my rhinestones is a very cute so i'll be doing that my tip i think i just put them here because this is what they'll be doing anyways i got my cutter and my brush and my little brush holder right here in the back and this one will be going on my drawer this i'll be having it out on my hand when he near me so when my clients come i'm going to just grab it the same thing as this this goes right here with my other set of rhinestones and this is it for this whole box um, another thing I got to do was I bought myself a starter kit for nails, acrylic nails, because, um, they were doing a course over there and I really, really wanted to do it, obviously to get more education on it, obviously to keep improving myself. I do got my certification right now. I'm doing two, um, online courses as well um to get my sort of and with those two online courses i do also receive my two certifications and then i feel like once i have absorbed like all this good knowledge within the nail technician industry or within the nails industry i am going to be going for my license because that is my ultimate goal i do want to get my actual nail technician license so in the future, I could open my nail salon. Like that's a big dream I have, or like my biggest goals of all is to run my own nail salon. So I, like I said, I did wanted to do the course, but um, unfortunately, I found out um, a little too late for it because I had like four days before my return flight back home and i wasn't able to do it because obviously the time frame and the time management and then i still had to go and look for my stuff that i wanted to bring because that, that i kind of did it last minute well no not last minute but i scheduled it within a couple of days before my flight just so i was able to like pack my stuff and you know have it everything going around um yeah i got meanwhile I'll show you um the other stuff that I um I have. For example, my aprons. 
I am a Mexican. My background and my culture is Mexican. I was born in Mexico with, and then, you know, my mom brought me over to the United States, but just recently I became a US citizen last year. So this, um, my mom, my mom went for vacation like three years ago. Well, she went this year to buy like three years ago. I got this apron that I told her to bring it to me just because I love embracing my culture. I love all the cute things that they have. Like it's just so cute. And it's just um Frida Frida Kahlo's doll and maintaining the Mexican colors and has a guitar representing our culture and music. Y dice Viva la Vida, Viva Mexico. Um, I think this was an addition for for Mexican um, Mexico's Independence Day, which is coming up on September 15. Is Mexico Independence Day? So I thought that is cute. It does have pockets in, so I could charge clients. They give me money. I could put my cash in here. I don't know, but I was liking the vibe, and I am obsessed with aprons. Like I'm, I think I believe I'm an apron collector and um that's what i got well not this one I, I didn't get this this one my mom brought it to me when i asked her when she asked like what is something um i'd like to bring over there and then i told her i want an apron it is waterproof the material is waterproof so it goes perfect within my daily activities because I could use it for the kitchen dishes all of that but I had it in my kitchen originally I was using it for the kitchen but then I washed it and brought it back to my nail room just so I could do that like I said some summer's coming up so I'll be most likely using this this was why it was on the top because I'll be using this within the season of you know September and then I also got this one. This one now I got myself right now. Um, I have this girl right here. I believe she's from the Princess. What's she? She Princess Jasmine. Can I see? She's from like Aladdin, I think. Oh no! Yeah, correct me up in here because I don't know my my movies like that. No, I haven't watched all the princesses, Disney's all that. Up again, it has the pockets. This is a clear pocket. It has a divider right here in the middle between the pockets. Well, just wait, wait. oh yeah, just just right here. But um, then it unifies. Like it has like two entryways, but then again, this whole thing unifies. It it is waterproof material. Um, this material is, is like nylon, like kind of like plasticky. Again, I feel like it's real cute to receive my clients and don't have all the dust on me and on my clothes. So, this is very amazing. Um, I have like quite more. Cause I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I just kept seeing them and everything that I would see, I'd be like, oh, that would look good for me when I'm working or like, I just like the design and then I would just go ahead and get it again because everything was so affordable. Um, I was able to get it like for real. Okay, now this one. Now this is really cute. This is more of like a cloth, um, what is this? Like cotton type. And it goes crossed in the back. It crosses in the back. And look at this, y'all. Like, look at this. It has zippers. It has a zipper up here. And as well as in these deep pockets. The pockets are deep. It's a navy blue. And I just get to like do it like that, like, like, yeah. They can tell me this ain't pretty. Like, look at this. And then it also crosses the back cross. 
and i feel like this is perfect for valentine's season it has the mini mouse i thought it had um mickey on it as well but i guess i was wrong or yeah or maybe it could be mickey's design on the pink and i guess i don't know but this is cute for like fun times so yeah like i said i think i thought of every season because this is these are the ones that i have right here as of now i still have to unpack i believe i have like two more in my other suitcase because we had like freaking five five bags of luggage like suitcases and shit and then pan bags and all that so it was so much again i bought other items from my culture this is again this is also waterproof and this is just a very cute doll a raggedy uh, a mexican raggedy doll this one only has one pumpkin which i don't mind because again um people sell me the money they use their their online transactions things or the get the cash then it'll be good but look at these colors they're so bright so vibrant colors again is the rainbow like like i like everything the vibe the green the yellow is so colorful so rich of color and i feel like i look cute doing my little nails yeah so um these are the three that i have here for now but like i said i still have my halloween ones is yeah halloween and another doll like this the same doll but in different colors like white and orangey um because it's like that one was for the season of um this little doll's name is called lele you know in my culture is it se llama la muñequita lele and i also have her <laughs> on my right here my working area space so it was a on the same one but on a, a different design with orangey for day of the dead Dia de los muertos and then another black one with like skeletons for like halloween and everything so i feel like i have one for each season after halloween october there's thanksgiving and then uh, if anything i'll just need a freaking design for christmas that's all i need but that is my obsession with aprons um what else oh my nail kit my nail kit now that was a deal oh my nail kit and i was impressed with the whole nail kit it came in this clear bag plastic bag that it's really cute it is a hot pink like a pink bag very girly very feminine and i am excited to use this brand because the brand of the whole set like it's to die for i've heard about it but us doesn't carry it i've tried ordering from them i've tried um everything searching it online but unfortunately it's a company that um doesn't do shipment to the u.s or it still doesn't have the permissions and restrictions that they'll need to go through in order to sell them here but i've heard very good reviews of them and i was just excited to like be able to get a hold of them and again my course I was too late for it. I found out I'm not late. <laughs> oh, so I wasn't able to do the course, but I did get the nail kit. I purchased it for separate, um, you know, from the airport. And I was just impressed because when you take courses here in the US, 
originally you don't get the nail drill or the nail lamp and this kit came with the led nail drill lamp so let's go ahead and open that first this is the biggest thing in the package everything is new it's on its box it's sealed it has the charger inside and it's just the typical um you know the sun sun x5 max there's an led the uv and LED, led nail lamp it does have the four buttons for your seconds to dry like 10 seconds 30 60 and then nine seconds i do already have on this one already in the past that i've used so it's good to just have this one as you know as a backup or i could start using it for my pedicures have one in my pedicure area um for pedicures and then have one on my nail desk for my nails and she put in very good quality products in it like over here fantasy nails fantasy nails um does have a u.s um business well like you could get it in the u.s your shipment and everything or order directly and it's just cuticle oil so this is really cute so again i got a deal on this because like i said each item has its own prices and i got everything in pesos so it was a really good deal then i have my three files my buffer um my natural nail buffer for natural nails and then i have my grid 100 100 for the acrylic nails so this for like once the acrylic is applied this is for natural nails when you do the prepping and the spongy nail file the buffer so it's so cute look at that look at that presentation it's so cute so they have really good grid on each file so three files next i have some nail forms in order to do sculpting acrylic nails so i believe this is like about 50 60 looks kind of of nail forms so that's good then i have another brush I'm not sure. No, this is not a Kalinsky brush or a Kalinsky brand. Um, the brand I've been seeing a lot is this one. Xiaoya. 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 I don't know. But let's open it and see. I do like that it has its cap to cover the brush. That's something I do like and enjoy. Let's see the tip. It's a size number eight. And well, I think it's synthetic. I don't think it's a Kalinsky brush. But it looks a really good sizing for the gel to do gel nails apply them or to do the um 3D flowers. It does have the really slim thing so it's really cute and again it has its own cap so that's always convenient to avoid the bristles to go over so let's just keep doing that on my brush collection or do i keep it in a box with everything well let's start using it Oh, okay. Now, this is some um, cuticle scissors. Wow. Stainless steel. Wow, this is very heavy duty. It feels heavy. Well, not heavy, heavy, but the quality of the scissors feels really good. And the tip is bended, curved a little. Yep, it's curved to just allow me to do my work even better and faster it has 
precision for the cuticles. So that's very awesome. Okay. Next, uh, this is the brand. It's called Wapisima. Wapisima. And this is just the nail glue, the resin to glue on the nail tips. So I got a thingy of them. So garbage. Wapisima. Then we have a gel polish top coat. The gel top coat that it's UV. And it's again, everything is from the same line except the cuticle oil was, is from Fantasy Nails, which is also a very good brand. So, like I said, I feel like I did very good getting this deal. And oh my god, I am livid for the packaging. Look at this adorable white and gold packaging and 15 ml like this is a good amount of product in here so we have nail glue the UV top coat again same brand this is a natural cover a nude cover shade of acrylic and the packaging I am cute cute, cute. and this is a sanitizer spray from the same brand Wapisima and it smells like flowers I haven't sprayed it but I'm pretty sure it smells really good and you just like freaking thingy the monomer good size 240 ml of monomer and again it has the scent of flowers the acrylic monomer won't smell as concentrated and as bad as the original one without no um you know no scent on it and it does say low smell or low odor everything is in spanish because again this is a mexican brand what and um you know it's in spanish but i got that next we have the clear acrylic and look at that look at that packaging like cute then we have the white it's called snow white white powder acrylic then we have two brushes cute little brushes to dust away all of the dust um, in the back it does show the list of things that you could use this for and it shows the scissors critical scissors safety scissors nail nipper eyelash curler deluxe nail clipper tweezers nail file or puff to like wash them and dust off as well and then again in this kit i have a nail tip cutter which is in the same rainbow shade a rainbow chrome color which is very cute my dappin dish for my monomer and uh, my cuticle pusher and then we have tips this one has 500 tips from the brand these are in clear again the box heavy duty these are in the tip coffin So I'm telling you, like this whole thing, it's a deal. And then I had an extra long tips, a uh, C-carp. I think um, pretty shape with precision ready to apply. Yep. 
long bamboo soft gel tips okay this is for the gel soft gel tips again the box cute pink i could always refill and then what is this oh a uh, nail nipper again with the same rainbow chrome shade and this is all that included in my nail kit again everything is cleared out the bag itself very spacious very cute i could store this back up in here um i could start using this line right after i'm done with my open products that i already have files as well very good like i am in shock like i really feel like this whole acrylic starter kit was very worth it very good amazing products amazing amazing and i'll just be putting everything back in here to just keep it in its place oh because i do have material out in the open so i don't want to like clutter all of my stuff in This will also be ideal if um, I start doing um, home services, like I call that, like me going into the client's home, like this is all I need. I will just need to throw in a towel, my towel, and um, it will be cute. So, like, hello, you have everything all in one place. So very good. So that was my little shopping spree for my nails of course I did got other stuff for myself when it comes to like clothing shoes all of that within my culture and very cute items thank you for watching with me this video if you stayed until the end of this video and you like my nail content please comment down below or like it like the video share the video help me um get to know you and like grow in my channel being part of my family i was really happy and very excited and eager ready to show you and talk to you like everything that i did and um how everything went within my nails but again i came focused and ready to like just take over i'm also excited to start doing my um hand stance um, nail design so i could just showcase it and i feel like it will be a really good time to start doing this so for the halloween season so i could start with that like fall designs and stuff um you know i feel like it will be something very good for me 
and thank you you guys for watching thank you if you are here from like day one i really appreciate you i really really um want to keep growing as well and like keep doing more content um just now that you know why i came from vacation and then me and my family we got sick um because of change of weather so it took me you know like a week um in order for me to create this video like i came home i had a very bad sore throat that i you know i didn't have voice like i couldn't speak so now i feel a little bit better i'm able to um talk but um, I was just so, so excited to show you guys what I did and my first um, nail content video ever to be uploading. So thank you. I really love that and appreciate you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.